Hello my pinkies and welcome back to another plan with me. Yay! So this week plan with me we're going to use kit B in my May mystery kit. I will also be using some of the freebies that comes with the mystery kit and some leftovers from my previous plan with me as you can see here that I'm just taking them out. Okay, so this week plan with me, we're going to plan May 22nd to May 28th. Let's get planning. We are going to start with the date covers on top first. Before we do, I'm just going to add my date dots on top of the date stickers so that I know it's the correct dates before I cover them up. So when I choose my washi tape, I usually actually do it when I film. I do not pre-select my washi tape. And what I usually do is that I spread out all the sticker sheets as you can see here. And then I pick from a pile of washi that I have and bring them over and just do my elimination dance of the washi. Like obviously I won't be using all 12 of these washi so I'm just going to eliminate and maybe narrow it down to 4 to 5. Even though the washi I decide to use for the bottom is a bit transparent, I'm not worried about putting another label underneath that just to cover the dots on the paper because the washi itself is already decorative and it's already really busy so even the, if the dots show through it won't really show through as much. And plus I know I'll be layering another washi on top of that so I'm not too worried about it. So I'm going to repeat the same thing on the other side. But just to break down the busy washi that I just put down, that I'll put a solid pink washi layer on top with gold foiling. So super pretty, so girly with the bows and the lashes and the hearts. Both of these washi are from the recollection tube that I got at Michael's. Next, I'm going to work on the washi for the top. I've decided to use this scallop pink bow, not bow, sorry, what am I talking about? Scallop pink washi tape up here, and I'm going to layer another washi tape on top because I do like the scallops, but not on its own like that, and I want to add some more colors into this weekly spread. So I'm going to layer a uh, blue and gold pineapple washi tape and I'm going to repeat the same thing on the other side so this week's spread I am using my mystery kit B in my May mystery kit and it's the HP version of obviously glossy and this spread will be a no white space spread because I do want to use up all my stickers and I think with the kit A it was a white space spread so I do have a lot of extra sticker to use for this week's spread. So my structures for my weekly plans are that the top part will be my today's, midsection is my full boxes and decorative items and then the bottom section are my to-do list. I do do only up to five days, not the whole week, because I like to leave the weekend uh, free, being free and nothing to do, because, you know, we need to relax too. We can't just keep on do, do, doing things all day, every day, right? Okay, here I am just debating what to put in my midsection, because it's usually all my full boxes and decorative elements. And with my mystery kit, you do get five full boxes in each weekly kit so in total you do get 10 but right now I've used five and now I only have five left so I'm just debating um, what I should do with the other two dates usually I will cover it up with scrapbook paper 
Right now I'm just going through some of my scrapbook paper. I also found these quote cards that I actually cut out for my previous climate to me. I think it was in April that I wanted to use them but didn't end up using it so I'm going to reuse them for this spread because the color do match the spread itself. I am going to have it trimmed down a bit so it fits into the boxes and start putting down my full box. Next, I like to anchor my full boxes down with some decorative washi tape. Here I am just testing out what will work and what will not. Here I usually eyeball it just to make sure that it is lined up. And I'm going to add the washi to the bottom just to balance it out. Before I start doing my today's section, I decided to do my sidebar and I went with a diagonal pattern just to match the diagonal washi that I already used for my weekly spread. I love using my double sided tape here to adhere this scrapbook paper down because it is a heavyweight paper and I find that glue doesn't work as well as the double sided tape. And I'm going to trim the side off camera. I still have two full boxes left over from the kit, so I'm just going to use one of them as the top corner of the sidebar. And I can't forget my weekend banner. First thing I do in my today's section is to do my meal plan sticker so that I know what I'll be eating that day or planning my meals for that week. As I mentioned before that this is going to be a no white spread spread, so I decided to use this bigger washi tape as my white space filler. Monday here is a holiday, it's Victoria Day, so there's nothing open on that day. And it's going to be a family day for us, and on Tuesday I have a mummy night out that got rescheduled from last week, plus it's garbage day, not to mention that we have to pick up some groceries and also do some errands while I'm out there. I am also going to try to fit in a run for that day. Wednesday I have to submit summer camp forms for my kitties. I'm going to use that day to fulfill some orders and also to design. Thursday, I'm going to edit a few of these plan with me videos and my husband has hockey that day. Also, I'm going to try to do a run and do some research on the internet. Friday, I'm going to film my plan with me for next week. And also, Friday is my day to upload plan with me videos or videos onto the YouTube channel. Forgot that my son have a play date on Thursday. And if I have time on Friday, I'm going to use the rest of the time to design. Hopefully I could get my orders out by Thursday and have them shipped out by Friday. I couldn't find a reminder sticker, so I got this note to self sticker from the Mambi sticker value pack. Just to remind myself what I need to do that week too. As I said, for the weekend, I rarely like to plan anything for the weekend and just let it flow. So Sunday, just want to remind myself that my little one 
do have a dance class, but Saturday she doesn't have the gymnastic class. It got cancelled. Saturday is also our bi-weekly date nights and Sunday is going to be all day family day. And seeing that I'll be home on Saturday, I figured to do I could do some laundry too. Most of my mystery kit do come with decorative stickers, so here I am just using up all the decorative stickers to decorate the spread. On the sidebar, there's two empty spaces, so I found a perfect little sticker for the bottom and another quilt sticker for the mid part. And now it's time to fill it all in. And there you go my pinkies. I hope you enjoyed this plan with me video. I had so much fun with this spread and the color that I would not imagine to put them together. The light blue and the pink. Like it's just such a perfect pairing even with the greens. But anyways, I hope you enjoyed this plan with me. If you do, please give it a thumbs up and I will see you in my next video. Happy planning. Bye.